nearly 170 exhibitors from nine countries and regions are in Hong Kong for the International Medical Devices and Supplies Fair. The three-day event organized by the Hong Kong Trade Development Council offers a huge range of the latest medical devices and hospital and laboratory equipment. Among the eye-catching products on display, this local innovation, it's the first in the world to combine infrared and laser technology in a device that has the effect of traditional moxibustion and acupuncture. The NTC can control the temperature in order to make sure that the temperature will not exceed 52 degrees Celsius to protect the patients. There's a lot of parameters over here. They will adjust the parameter suitable for this patient, and the patient can use this product in their homes and do it themselves. Call for help. Emergency medical care is also finding its way into offices and homes with devices like this U.S.-developed heart defibrillator. Offered by a Hong Kong distributor, it provides step-by-step -step reminders about life-saving first aid. Press flashing shock button. Shock one delivered. It is safe to touch the patient. Begin CPR now. And as populations around the world age, there is a growing variety of items designed to maintain health, like this French design machine that has more than 400 exercises for every range of ability. For example, the strength is target on the localized area. You do the same posture. The people is aging. So this is the trend, it's not only in Hong Kong, but all over the world. Most of the people looking for how can work for anti-age exercise is one of the good things to do, but most of the people think that exercise is too difficult for them. But our machine can make it like a very funny game to improve our posture during the games. In Hong Kong, you can find many elderly houses with uh, luxury facilities. The elderly is not poor and they're looking for health. So I think the market in Hong Kong as well, the elderly looking for the good things. Local innovation is also making waves at the international event with devices like this. Developed by V-Health, with research done at the Chinese University of Hong Kong, the interactive weight-bearing platform stimulates muscles and bones, a major help for elderly patients. Medical and healthcare equipment is a robust industry in Hong Kong, with exports of such gear reaching 359 million U.S. dollars in the first quarter of 2012, up 28% from the same period last year.